In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, one God, Amen. Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace and goodwill towards men. المجد لله في الأعالي وعلى الأرض السلام وبالناس المصرة. The Gospel of Saint Luke, chapter 2, verse 14. And if you go and search for this uh, for this unique Bible verse, glory be to God and the highest and peace on earth and goodwill towards men, you will find. The, different translation glory to God in the highest and peace on earth and to those with whom God is pleased and with goodwill towards men and and to those whom God is pleased and you can also if you see it in uh, in Arabic translation to the people who are pleasing God. Goodwill towards men for those who are, for those men who are pleasing God, this is the the response. So in many times we are searching for peace. One of the names of God is the King of Peace. And we are searching for the inner peace all the time. There was a man who killed his girlfriend and he buried her and she disappeared and it was uh, uh, assigned to an unknown uh, criminal and the, no one was caught and the research in this crime was closed. But the inner peace is being lost in the heart of this man for day after day, for night after night, for years and years and years, till the passion of Christ, the film of the passion of Christ was released. Film of the Alam al-Masih. And he said, you know what, I'm doing nothing. I will go and watch the movie. He went and he watched the movie of the passion of Christ. He started crying and crying and crying after the movie. Then he went out in the movie theater all the way to the police station. And he confessed everything, though there was no accusation. He was not even in the alleged list. list. Because of the lack of peace, he said, you know what, it is better for me to be in prison while having peace than to be in my home and losing peace. But he, lo- he, he gained his peace when he confessed his sin. The problem is sometimes the loss of peace is the, I feel uh, when, when your car is giving you a uh, yellow light blinking, there is something wrong in the car, the oil needs to be changed, the, the battery needs to be charged, whatever it is, there is an alarming and losing peace is one of those uh, parameters in our life that there is something there is something maybe I need to work on losing peace in my heart losing peace in my relationships losing peace in the church losing peace in work it is very important to be aware that the Lord that when the angel, and suddenly there was an angel, a multitude of heavenly hosts praising God and saying, the, the, the angels don't appear out of nowhere when the shepherds are going all the way to see Christ who is born, or the baby born in a manger. <coughs> and suddenly there was with the angel a multitude of heavenly hosts praising God and saying, glory to God in the highest and on earth peace and goodwill towards men or those who are pleasing God will get the the peace on earth. So it goes in that sequence. If you want to have peace in life, then give the glory to God first. It's not my my glory. 
It is not my, uh, uh, my family's glory. It is not my achievement. It is not my pride. It's not what I have achieved. It's not what I have. It's not what I do or what I have or people are saying about me. It is the glory to God. There was a, a, a priest who never liked preaching. Can, he doesn't give any sermons. Can visiting one of the villages, another Abuna told him, Abuna, you are a guest. We will gather the whole. I, I already ordered the news to be spread all over the village that you are giving us a spiritual revival, Nahbar or Hayya, at night. And all the people are coming and you are, you are giving it. He told them, and I don't give lectures, and I don't give sermons, and uh, this is, I don't have a, a talent. He told them, I'm sorry, Abuna, you are stuck. So I told him, okay. Abuna went at the time, he gave the sermon, and it, all the people, their mind was blown. Uh, how, how great is this sermon? And they all went to Abuna, we thank you for this great sermon. We never heard something like this, we are very happy, and, 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 and from where did you get all this information? And he told them, calm down, calm down, ta'alu ma'ala, come with me. They went all the way to the side of the altar, we opened the veil of the altar, where can see five of the youth of that church were praying. What are you praying for? Alulu, we are praying for your sermon that God will give you a word to the people because we know that you, you sucks in giving sermon. Alulu, Alulu, this is the situation. He didn't get the glory. We saw, and many times we get the glory to us or we give the glory to our upbringing or our, how smart we are or how, our, how uh, yani, hardworking we are and how wise we are and how good we have done this. But this Abuna, he knows the key. He, knows, he opened the veil along. Eh, this is the prayer of those youth that God is giving me. He gave the credit. He glorified God back. Without putting glorifying God in every single day, Rabbina Alf in the book of Isaiah, in kunta aban fa'ayna karamati, in kunta sayyidan, if I am your father, so where is my dignity? And if I am your master, then where is my honor? So if we are glorifying God because it says glory to God in the highest and peace on earth and goodwill towards men, in order to regain this peace, we need to always give the, the glory to God. The beginning, after you make the sign of the cross in the beginning of every day, لو بنصلي بالأكبية نقول إيه Glory to the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit oh, The first thing you say We give God the glory We give God the credit From من يدك أعطيناك One guy was uh, Was debating about uh, donation And this too much And why, why we should give 10, 10% of all what we have of all our money, this is ridiculous. And anyway, so he had uh, an old man in his family. He told him, "Okay, think of this." He 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 brought him. He opened his hand. Well, okay. You are. And he took a small piece of uh, of paper and said, okay. "You are this piece of paper." This is the hands of God, okay? And okay. And God is giving you another, yani giving you income, giving you blessing, give you, giving you something. He's giving, uh, uh, this small little paper is on a, this, this piece of a, of paper which is representing this person. And in the Bible it says, Min yadak a'taynak. From your hand, we are giving you. So what you are doing simply, you are moving the, the, the blessing that you have from on you and putting it aside, which is in the hands of God as well, because you are still in the hands of God and still everything in the hands of God. And now we are giving the glory to God. The problem is we keep comparing, we keep competing with the people are around us and we, we keep forgetting who has blessed us with this, who has given us this, who has uh, uh, blessed us in every single day. 
in order to regain the peace on earth, in every home, in every uh, heart, in every family, in every church, in every setting, you need to give glory to God in the highest first. You need to glorify God in your deeds, in your thoughts. All the one who glorify God is always complaining or thankful. He's always thankful. The one who glorifies God is always taking and and I was, I was, I was, I was. Sometimes our our time or our prayers think is it a petition or a praise? Are we, are you petition? Dini Abu Rabbana eh, after Nama Bahad Kati petition is writing a petition, a request to do something. So our our prayers is glorifying God or it is just requests of things, Kun Ma'alayal, who bless me in this, who help me in this, who give me this, who I want this, who I hope for this, and uh, heal this and uh, remove this from my life. It's all about requesting, 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 requesting things, or really, really praising God. Ashen Kida, we have a golden opportunity for Kinesis, as Mat Tazbeha. The midnight prayers is a golden opportunity. Mabish had the Mutahail. How beautiful is it, Tazbihat? Because it is one of the very, 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 very few things that we are doing in the church that no request. We are just praising God. Oh, give thanks to the Lord for He has done, given, has done uh, mercy for. Oh, give thanks. Oh, give thanks. Oh, give thanks. Oh, give thanks. Oh, we are praising, we are praising, praising. We praise God in Arab uh, Salim for the how wondrous he did with the three holy youth. We keep praising God. The only request that we request for Salat uh, Tazbihah, you know what? Forgiveness of sins. <laughs> That's it. We ask only for forgiveness of sins. Forgiveness of sins, forgiveness of sins, forgiveness of sins. Look a nice story with Omena Irini about Tazbihah. There was a saint uh, there was a, a, a nun, her name is Naha Ummina Martha. Well, Ummina Martha, maybe you, it's a very popular story, maybe you have heard about it, but she was not, not attending every Odess, not being there all the time, and uh, she can sleep in for Tazbiha midnight, come to the liturgy late. So Ummina Irini, Ummina Martha departed, she died, and Ummina Irini was worried. She said, you know what, I don't know what's going on with Ummina Martha. And this is, uh, she, she really became worried about her. So she kept praying, 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 praying. And one day she said, you know what, this is not going to work out. Every prayer, every stikhun, uh, when you are praying, the, the commemoration of the saints. When you are remembering the commemoration of the saints, uh, Forgive us our sins. So, call the prayer. They are in Tifkan and Novi Nani Vol, Utamini Ala Omina Mersa. How many stichons? 72. She kept saying every stichon, Ubad in Tifkan and Novi Nani Vol, Tamini Ala Omina Mersa. She finished the 72 stichons. Let Ummina Mersa in front of her. She, had, she told her, make the sign of the cross. She did the sign of the cross. So again, make the sign of the cross again. She made the sign of the cross. Ummina Irini Kahki. So what's going on? Are you, are you okay? She, she told her, Ummina Mersa, she said, oh, I'm, 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 I'm very happy. Everything is fine. And I'm all, I'm all in a very nice place. And don't worry. I am in paradise. You did in Tamalti is a lot of confusion in heaven. Everyone, all the, my name has been called 72 times with all the people, and everyone is asking God that I will come. So that's why I'm here. What's going, what's going on? At that time, I was worried. I don't know where, where have you been. That's why I was praying. And at that time, tell me what are the things. We know that you were lazy, you know, we know that you were not yani, that diligent, we, we know everything. But that's why I was worried. So tell me what really make you make it to that nice place in paradise. And I was doing only three things. First thing, 
I never hold grudges against anyone. I never hold grudges against anyone. I never for, not forgive anyone. I always I give forgive and forgive and forgive. And remember, forgive and you will be forgiven. It was said to Erfiru, you're So I never hold grudges or not, not forgive anyone on anything, whatever they have done to me. Number two, I will always making peace between people. Two nuns are having tension between them. I go to the first nun, I will tell her, you know what? The, the first nun was speaking very highly of you. She respects you and she loves you and she honors you. Even when no one is around her, I know this because I have seen her do this and this and this and that. To Tanya, to you know what? She, she, the best, uh, she was very tired, she had a very hard day. What she said, she didn't really mean it. And I know that she really, really loves you from all her heart. Al-Ghufran, forgiveness, awal haga. Number two, making peace. Tub al-Sani'i al-Salam, la'anahu yud'awun a'i. Abna Allah, blessed are those who make peace. Because they will, call be, they will be called sons of God. And sons of God means that they will inherit. If you are a son, then you inherit the kingdom of heaven. Forgiveness and not holding grudges, making peace. And the last thing she told her, uh, is a small allowance to the monks. Very, very little amount of money that you get as an allowance to, if you want something personal, if you want to get something, whatever. So she take all her allowance. She has a couple of people that she knows in uh, from Muslim Adina that they are serving the poor. She take all the allowance. She give it to the people who are serving the poor to love a help with this money in any any poor or any needy person. So all what she had, she was giving to the poor. And she told her, those are the three things that I was really doing. And, and it's a long story, but it is amazing. It is amazing the power of tasbiha and the power of standing in front of God, not asking for anything. Think of if you are interacting with any of your friends or any of your uh, even parents or kids, who call them a chief, we complain. Every day complaining. Every day complaining. You never did this to me. You are not fair. This is not fair. Why you are doing this? I called you and you never replied. You always uh, complains, complains, complains. Call them a chief, complains. That church is uh, is not good. That priest is not good. The servant is the complains, complains, complains. Oh, chief. The next day. When you have any interaction with this person, would you really want to see the person? <laughs> and I was peace in my heart, in my mind. God, when we keep complaining, 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 complaining in front of God, this is not a, an attitude of someone who is glorifying God. This is an attitude of someone who is guilt tripping God or want to put. God, or he is entitled for a better and he is not appreciating. But if someone calls him a like, I love you. Thank you for all what you have done to me. I really appreciate all, all your effort. I really care for you. Thank you so much. I love you. I love you. I highly appreciate what you are doing. The first thing that to come to your mind is, I want to give him more. I want to, to support him more. I, well, this is what happens with Tazbih. We love you. We praise you. And Lao Samah, please forgive us our sins. So, may God give us to know that uh, the sequence is glory to God in the highest and on earth peace and goodwill towards men. It comes in this way. We give God the glory in our time. We give Him the glory in our day. We give Him the glory from even our, the things that we have. We always give Him the credit back. It makes a huge difference and he will pour on our hearts this unlimited peace that is surpassing all understanding to whom is the glory forever and ever. Amen.